everyone! We have a new sort of video for this channel today. As you can tell from the title, we're doing an organizing video today. So I will be putting all of the goodies from the last haul I did in my ranger. I have a good chunk of stuff to put away because it was kind of like an intense haul. So um, I do have some 4x6s, postcard book, the troll stuff, some of the spar stuff, a few pins to put away in my pin board, stickers, and a good little um, pile of photo cards. I will show you, yeah. So I definitely have to put all of these BBs away. And yeah, let's get started. Okay, so first of all, let's put away the red velvet items that go in my bigger binder, which has most of my red velvet photo cards. It's like a pretty, She's, she's a bit thick. This is basically everything from debut to LaRouche in chronological order. So first, yeah, first we have to put away these cards. I actually already sleeved them, but ooh, they're sticking together. That is not okay. These are the Red Velvet um, Bad Boy Kino cards, not the ones that were random. So I will be putting these away first. Bad Boy, okay. So, I do have both of Joy's already on this page, but I do want to put the other members in. I used to have two of these sets, but I sold the other one and kept the ones that Pineapple gave me in a giveaway. So, let's take these placeholders out because I've been waiting to do this. Oh my god, and please don't judge my binder too much. I really need to do a big cleanup of it, and I have so many placeholders that I have to make, and <laughs> I have really not gotten here yet. I'm a bit on a slow mode, I feel, but let's see. We gotta put Irene first, so Irene will go here. Oh, I hate uh, horizontal cards are the vein of my existence. Rip Silky fans <laughs> forever. Um, Silky, I'm gonna put these here, but we'll see where I put them in the end. Wendy, horizontal, and then Yeti and her horizontal. So let's see, let's put... Let's put all the normal ones first, the ones that are vertical like usual, um, Yeti, and then start putting their horizontal cards up. Okay, here's the thing, I also have the bad boy stickers here, so I finally got a set of the bad boy stickers and I've been meaning to get these for a second. I already had Joyce, but I do collect stickers for every member because <laughs> it's my way of being able to keep them. Um, keep something at least of each member now that I'm not collecting OT5 so I do have all of these to put away thing is yeah these circle cards don't really fit well in here <laughs> I hate it when I have to do this okay um, maybe they will fit in white ones like this do they fit in white ones they kind of do okay whatever SM circle stickers or whatever let's <laughs> figure this out I'm gonna take her out and let's put that cuter group card. I am very biased with the bad boy era. I hate this photo shoot. I don't think it's bad. Like, don't get me wrong. I don't think this is like, there's anything inherently wrong with this shoot. I just don't like, like very unlit dark concepts. Like I like colors a lot. So I'm gonna put this photo card here. Maybe I could put one of these like this and then the other be on the side. That could work, and it would be only be for members, right? Okay, here's my blasphemy confession. I low-key cut up the sticker I had so that it would fit in here because I was frustrated at these not fitting, so mm, let's see. <laughs> I feel kind of embarrassed now that I did that, but <laughs> let's. I'm gonna put these cards in here regardless. First, so Irene. I think we should remove this so we can put at least a group card in here. Like at least one of them. I think I won't have space for the other one technically, so I'm just gonna put it backwards, I guess. Let's put this um, sideways, like a sleeve page over here. Everything's in, yeah. Okay, so maybe we can then do this. So let me grab one of each because Red Velvet stickers always come with duplicates if you buy them as they came originally. Miss Irene, get her under, Silky. Honestly, I really want to go back to collecting OT5 Red Velvet. 
saying no to that collection has come back to haunt me time and time again. I feel like it was the right thing to do, considering I have student loans. <laughs> yeah, I think it made sense to sell them and just be more careful with my money, but I do kind of still regret it. I can't help but regret it. Like. Red Velvet really is my old group, There's, it's the group that got me into K-pop in the first place and it's just a lot to think of not... <laughs> I don't know, because collecting has become such a hobby for me. I really do want my OT5 collection back, but I have been thinking, what if I just like... Oh no, she goes here. She goes here. Um, what if I like, you know, I feel like I could. How do I say this? Like collect museum cards, you know? Because SM sells prints of their photo cards and I'm like, I could technically get each photo card for three bucks even if it didn't come from the album. Um, this looks good, but what if we put, let's see, what if we put, because this has nothing on the back, right? Because they're stickers, so let me put these things behind, see if it looks a little more, more cohesive and then like the more colorful and cheerful cookie jar set won't pop through because it's kind of like a mood breaker. Let's grab the, these guys actually and we'll go back on that sleeving and put them in here because I think that'll make it look a little bit better. Should we put these other stickers behind? Sometimes I do that with pages that don't fit everyone. Um, maybe I'll do like a bigger spread later on though. Let's see. Okay, that's not bad. I think this is good now, right? Have these ones here, then the stickers, and then have this back here, right? Then next we have these guys, they are the Peekaboo sticker set. Yeah, so my Peekaboo era stuff is here. It's just one page for these. Um, and I did include the season's greetings down here because they feel like thematically similar. So we're gonna have to see how we fit these because there's two of each girl. I'm really happy I got these stickers, honestly. So, Yeti, Wendy, Lucky. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Oh, I love these photos. Um, Irene and Irene. And then they just have like hollow ones with like murder weapons and some logos. So we're gonna have to divide it between the front and the back, which is really annoying. Um, because I don't wanna leave Yeti on the back side and have her look just like really alone. <laughs> like I don't enjoy the idea of that. So maybe let's put the honey line here. And maybe we can put some of these stickers in here to fill it up a little. We should put um, some placeholders. Do I have enough? I need eight. Oh god, I need to buy more of these. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes, girl. Okay, and then if we flip it onto the other side, so let's actually, I'm gonna put them in the middle, I think, so that it looks more centered. So let me put Joy's here while I'm at it since it's flipped. Yeti. So let's put Peekaboo back here. Oh, I'm really happy to have these stickers. So finally, I am very slowly, but finally reaching most of my Red Velvet collection complete, so nice. Now I have Joy and Yeti back here, so that's cool. Okay, um, I think that's it for this Red Velvet binder, so let's switch to the other one. In the second one, what I have is everything from Finale to now, and then um, the 4x6 photos, and I do have two new sets of 4x6 photos, so let's hop on time to the Red Summer. Rookie My Queen 
And yeah, I did let some space behind for this. Okay, so I have both photo sets for the red summer and I'll show them real quick. So the group pick, Yeti, Joy, Wendy, Irene, and Sylvie. And then this other group pick, which I love. Oh, Irene, Sylvie, Yeti, Wendy, and Joy. I love that pick of her. Yeah, I think aside from these, I'm only missing Bad Boy now. Everything else is filled out. That's an accomplishment. <laughs> And this girl here. Ooh. <laughs> oh my god, would you look at that? We can actually go from rookie to red summer to peekaboo as it's meant to be. <laughs> okay, that's hot. That's hot, honestly. Um, I do have also this very rare um, photo. Oh, it does not fit in a postcard slot, I'm realizing. So we're gonna need to get a different page for her. Where the hell does she fit? Does she have to go in her own page? That's annoying, okay, so it'll go in a different space then. I do have the Zim Sullivan postcards, but I think let's go to the actual postcard binder. I have so many red velvet binders, it's dumb, but yeah, let's go on to the next one. I really am red velvet's bitch, am I not? <laughs> so. First of all, we have a really special set of cards, of postcards. Um, whew, I did not think I would be getting these anytime soon. They are the ice cream cake ones, but I realized I'm gonna need sleeves, so just one sec. I will show you them all real quick again. It is Irene, Wendy, Silky, Joy, Yeti. Oh, group pick. Group pick. Oh, so many group postcards for this era. So let's put the members aside. And oh, this binder is stuffed to the brim. I'm honestly gonna have to start consuming the other one. Um, maybe I should now, huh? I guess I have to put these girls in first and then I'll switch. Oh god, but it's gonna, they're gonna all come out if I just pop it out. So. Maybe let's move concert ones over there. I do have all the concert postcards, but I try not to... Um, oh yeah, let's move postcards and the Japanese releases over there. Oh, but I do have... Um, I do have these finale postcards back here. So I guess I'll leave, I'll leave those ones in here. Oh, but they... The day two ones, this is so annoying. Let's leave Japanese releases here then. No. But I do have the other two concerts, not just Red Mare, but the those come in like a little postcard book that's actually hardcover. And I don't really wanna break it apart. I might buy a second one one day and you know cut that one up and have it in my binder, but I really like having the other ones on display. Let's leave this here for now and just remove those last ones. I will have to do, oh, it's still filled to the brim. Like, she's thick. <laughs> she's not gonna fit in there that well. Um, fuck. Okay, mm, let's move these last ones then. Oh, that's a little better. It's still gonna be overstuffed, to be honest, but mm, I guess that's how life goes sometimes. So let's start with these ones and I try to pair them together so that they make sense so let's put these two together for sure because um, they're wearing the same outfits oh yeah and these two for sure okay yeah this kind of separated pretty well all right let's do these first because I really like them Pour me voir ou pour jouer avec eux, ta visite c'est de la tendresse ou de la provocation. 
Yes, cannot believe these girls are in my collection now. Can you believe? Oh, I'm winning. <laughs> nice, okay, so group photos first. Group photos. Yes. Okay, so this um, fourth red velvet binder has a bunch of random stuff. It's a bunch of three pocket sleeves mainly, so we have a bunch of Polaroids and then some A4s, ticket holders, um, <laughs> lots of random goodies. Actually, this smile box, I feel like I should put this kit behind it actually. So this is like very rare. <laughs> Yes, Sam called it a photo card, but it's actually more of a postcard. In fact, it's even larger than a postcard because it clearly will not fit in a normal postcard sleeve. Like, it's too big. It doesn't make sense. Um, but let's see. Should we put her behind this? Okay. And um, actually, let's switch these. I want her to be in front because she's special. And. I also hate that these stickers do not fit in the ticket holder. Like, it's so angering that it's just just short of fitting in. Honestly, I might cut them later. <laughs> when I get too frustrated, I'm just like, bring in the scissors. But let me hold on. I don't want to fix this right now. But I guess that's the point of this video. But I don't want to. I don't want to. Oops, I'm so sorry. I didn't realize it stopped filming, but. Basically, we are putting these girls in here. I low-key, I'm not gonna lie, I wanna put one of these up on my wall. Maybe even two. What should I put up there? Because I should also use these as decoration. They are way too cute. Um, I love this one a lot, I can't lie. Um, and I should put a hollow one too, right? Oh, it's so pretty. Um, let's do... Let's do this one, because it's cuter. Let's put these two on my wall. So I'm gonna put them aside. Maybe I'll get another set later for the binder, but that's kind of wasteful, so we'll see. If I don't have that one there, these will even out perfectly, because it would be five members plus the group one. So I'm gonna leave it outside. Don't tell anyone. And we'll see if I keep it there. There's this one, Irene's Sylvie. Miss Wendy, Joy, and Yeti. These are to die for. I cannot believe we've got the collab of the century. Like, this was such a look. It was so cute, and so many people learned about Red Velvet because of it, so I'm really happy. Yeah, these are Joy as far as Joey's is for postcards that came with her latest line of lipsticks with them. So, let's try to get these girls. Yeah, do they all fit? This might be good or this might be terrible. Oh no. I think they almost fit, but not quite. We're gonna have to do the three pockets. I think. Let's see if they fit in the three pockets. They do. Okay. Okay. We're in then with these. Hmm. I'm gonna put this one here. Oh no, but I want these two more to visible because I'm obsessed with these yellow ones. Like they're so pretty. Yeah, let's just put them backwards and I'll see what I put on top later on. Like we can probably put some similar good up there later. But that way I would have these guys like this together and let's make them the first set here. Okay, and then I'm just gonna put this in here in the meantime while I am less lazy and have a will to figure it out. Actually, let's do here. Okay, so for Wikimiki and Go On, I have these cards. Um, this one is a repeat, but I'll put it in my sailing page. Um, these are my Animal Crossing cards, which we'll go after. And yeah, so I have these guys basically. Um, so let's do Go On first because I finally got my Crunchy Queens two high high cards, which is unreal. I'm so happy to finally get these. Like, let's move these. Ugh, where would high high go? Basically here, right? So I'm gonna put these two up here. So I guess I'm, I technically, 
No, I'm still missing one card for the high high era, but I really need to make placeholders for these because I'm super behind on making placeholders with the raffle and a bunch of other stuff I've been doing, so let me just put her here. I'm technically only missing the other OT12 card, so the one where they're all standing up side by side. So I guess I'll put that one here and make some nice placeholders for here. In the meantime though, while we get placeholders, let's put these in there um, because I hate how it looks right now and the fact that you can see the cards that are behind it. It needs to make it feel a little more complete. So here is my Wiki Mickey one. So I do have this one for women of say. I'm very, very slowly filling out these pages. Like I have to make placeholders and put the washi, all of that. She is slow this time. But I do finally have a Lua Pola from the Wonderful Moments in Japan, which feels like a success. Let's put her here. And then the other um, say one that I was missing. So now I'm just missing one Lua, which I have not found yet. Let's put her here. And then I do have this Make Star card. I will be getting a full set of the Make Star cards. So I'm just going to put this one over here. And later on, I will give them their whole page once they get here. So that's good. And then... Ooh, these ones are pretty filled up, but I do still have these two items to put in. I don't feel like... Oh, no, this one isn't going to fit in there. So, yeah, let's actually use these four pocket pages from earlier and put them in here instead. So I'll just pop them both in here for now. And later on, we can clean this up and make it better and look presentable. So I just gotta say, my pin board really is that hoe. This is my pride and joy. I am so proud of her so far. I had to expand her because things were not fitting in here anymore. And soon enough, they will not fit again because I keep getting red velvet pins because I'm obsessed. But I do have all of the red velvet trolls pins to put in her. So Sulgi and Irene, Yeti, Joy, and Wendy. And I have this gorgeous OT5 pin that this amazing person sent me. Um, the person that made it, Vivian. I definitely want to put all of the Red Velvet girls together because I feel like it makes the most sense. Most of my pin board is separated by era and or color. Like I have peekaboo stuff over here, um, bad boy stuff over here, some Russian roulette stuff, red room, like red velvet specific, um, some of like the red, red summer over here, but um, I don't have it as like strictly divided though, so I'm trying to see. Let's leave space for something here, and I guess put them around here. Wait, no! Have they been out of frame this whole time? I think they're pretty cute at that point, right? <laughs> I like them there. So, aside from that one, we do have the LaRouche one. And I do have a LaRouche pin here that was like official. So maybe we can put this one down here, over here. I do have red more here, so it doesn't seem that out of place. It's like concert line, I guess. So maybe let's put this one here, especially because it's flat at the bottom. And I think it's good. Oh, I'm so happy I got these. <laughs> I'm so happy. I really love these pins. But yeah, I think this is mainly it. Thank you so much for watching all of this video. I hope it was fun. If you like this more organized with me sort of video, let me know so I can make more of them. So you can let me know if this was worth doing or if you hated it and you're like, no, just stick to unboxings, girl. That's what you do best. So <laughs> anyway, let me know. I hope everyone is well. I hope you have an excellent week, a lovely day, and I will see you in my next video. Ciao.